like I'm always just pooped by the end of the day. Just completely pooped. It goes lights, camera, action when I step into the limelight. Easily adapted to the high life. Dress to impress like it's prime night. And when you live in top shelf, you know you gotta set the bar high. Had the same dreams since we was kids. Big tips, big cars, and even bigger cribs. Never thought that it would happen just the way it did. Fast forward that now, it's just the way we live. That's good food and drinks. My mood makes you think that this life's made for a king. The room starts to shake, so smooth if you blink. You might just miss the whole thing. It's just a different way to move in the high. Good morning, beautiful people. Welcome back to another day in the life. It is Wednesday, July 29th. Uh, and I have a pretty busy day. I've already kind of been working and I need to go eat. <laughs> I'm so hungry, but I ate really late last night, which doesn't have my stomach feeling the best right now. So, I just decided to get a late start with eating and get some stuff done before I go eat. So, right now, I'm actually, we are doing 12 days of giveaways in the Eat Brand Club because July marked one year of having the club. We have over 750 members, which is just mind-blowing. And I just wanted to do something to give back to my e-bosses. And so I love all of you guys so much. And today we are giving, well, this is technically yesterday's giveaway, but it's a podcast mic, a Blue Yeti. And we have some really good giveaways in here. Um, but I've given away different things in the club before. iPads, strategy calls. Um, some of the gifts were um, gear, different types of gear, three months credit in the eBrand club, different gift cards. Um, you know, it's just been it's just been so fun. So I am about to post today's, yesterday's, and today's giveaways, and I need to choose some winners and then I have got some calls today we need to do the top three I feel like we haven't done the top three in a little while in a vlog so let's do the top three okay so record three YouTube videos I need to sign some contracts um, and send some contracts sign and send then I need to do the August calendar for the eBrand Club. So that is the top three for today. Let's get it. A lot of you guys have been asking me if I'm still doing before our work week. If you haven't seen that video, you should check it out. I'll leave the th put the thumbnail right here, but I'll also link it in the description. But basically I experimented with working four hours a day. I will say that that is the goal to be able to condense my days to four hours, but it's just not very realistic for me. I do, however, want to be done working by 4 p.m. So if I can be done with everything by 4 p.m., I think I will be very, very happy. And then I can adjust the time depending on how much work I have. Like, okay, Erin, you should wake up at 6 a.m. and get going. Um, or if I have meetings, like making sure they're scheduled early in the day. Um, so that way, you know, I still have time to do other things. Um, so four hours, not really. I feel like I'm still in that state of entrepreneurship where I do have to dedicate quite a bit of time, although I am building out my team. So it's not, I don't have as much on my plate as I once did. And so that's been very nice. I will share with you guys um, how that is going with building out my team and some of the new roles that we're um, that we are hiring for Aaron on Demand, which I'm so excited about. And so, uh, yeah. So I just wanted to give you guys a little update on that. 
All right, let me do some work. For lunch, I'm having some roasted sweet potatoes. I made these tuna cakes and they are so good. Spinach, and I threw a piece of grilled chicken on here just for a little extra protein, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to eat this lunch um, and work on video outlines while I'm doing that. I have a one o'clock call and then I have a two o'clock call. So I probably won't be able to start recording until about three, which is not ideal. Today is one of those days where I wish I woke up a little bit earlier and got the big stuff out the way and so that after the call I could be done. But, you know, it's fine. I'll probably be recording till about five if I start around 3, 3.30. So that is that, I'm gonna eat. Mm, this is really good. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll watch a YouTube video while I eat. Who are some of your favorite YouTubers right now? I'm always interested in watching new content. So, let me not. Lunch was delicious. Those tuna cakes are so good. I don't even really care for tuna. Actually, I don't like tuna. So I don't really know what compelled me to make tuna cakes, but um, I tried a recipe. I think I just kind of got sick of eating chicken, ground turkey, salmon, chicken, ground turkey, salmon. And um, I'm really just trying to eat things that give me a good balanced diet because you guys know I, I don't know if I told you, I got a trainer. Um, he is incredible. And so, I need to have like a high healthy carb and high protein diet and I know tuna has a lot of protein in it. So I was like, let me just try something different and they are really good. So I'll leave the recipe uh, linked in the description if you guys wanna try it. I do have a call in one minute. It's a Zoom call for a potential speaking engagement. So I'm gonna hop on that and I will see you guys after. She bought me quick and mixing up the different products, kiss your problems under my liquor bottle and gender like to make a gender generalize the women that I'm sitting next to. I just wrapped my first meeting. It was uh, about a 20 minute call. It's 1.30, I have a 2 p.m. call. And so in the meantime, I'm going to set up so that once that 2 p.m. call is done, I can run upstairs and change for recording. So I'm gonna get some recording in today. My hope is to get three videos recorded, plus I'm blogging, so that makes four videos in a day that I can send over to my editor and she can get going with that, um, which would be fantastic. So let's get set up so that we don't waste this little time in between meetings. Just got a check. Just flipped it on a home for a jet. Just got a new fun. Just cut it. I literally hate recording when the room is a mess. Another thing I forgot to tell you guys is I'm really gonna try to get like 10 to 15 videos recorded um, over the next month because with moving. Um, we just have so much going on right now, so I need to have content just stacked up to, to prevent me from having to be like worried about uploading in the midst of all of the stuff that I have going on right now. So I'm going to try to get four videos recorded today, possibly record another four tomorrow and that's eight videos in two days and then I'm just worry free. And I think moving forward, like every month. In the first week of the month, I will try to record eight videos. And then throughout the month, I'll vlog and, you know, do one-off videos here and there. But I'm not worried about, like, oh, my God, I don't have enough content. And I just will constantly be ahead. It'll be easy for my team to kind of organize, schedule out, make the thumbnail, do all the things without it being at the last minute. So, anyway, just wanted to update you guys on that. And now I'm going to clean up. Just got a new black room for my set. Everything foreign and expensive I collect. I am ready for my 
call at 2. It's 2.05, but the number that they gave me is not working properly. So I don't even know. I sent the email, but I'm not sure. Uh, there was just some great, you had some great content, so I just started watching your videos and stuff like that. And then I just reached out. I can see, I can see I'm losing my vision. I just changed. I wrapped up the call. Um, and it was a great call. So, it is 4.30. I still have not recorded. So, I'm going to go ahead and record. I'm going to try to at least get one or two videos in. I'm not going to push too hard for three. But, I also got a little special delivery. I'm going to show you guys. Um once I finish recording. So, I just put up a video. It's all about seven streams of income and how, well, it's not about seven streams of income. It's about how to create and grow multiple streams of income. So, um, that is today's video. I'm gonna do a little posteroo about it on my Instagram stories really quick before I start recording. I was trying to airdrop this to myself, this little trailer. Oh, it's there. So why isn't it showing up when I try to? Oh, here it is. Okay, there we go. All right, so I'm gonna post this, record, and I'll see y'all in a second. Thank the holy trio. I feel like CEO. I'm better than my dream. All right, I just finished recording video number dos and I'm so glad I got two videos done because typically when it's this late in the day I end up just punking out and not doing them and just saying whatever I'll just record tomorrow but I got, including this one, three videos done. I still haven't hit the four video mark. I don't know if it's a mental thing or what, but it's okay. The world is not over. Um, I am going to eat some dinner because I'm very, very hungry. I haven't eaten since that tuna patty, which was delicious, but that has worn off completely and um oh what i wanted to show you guys so i tried out rent the runway i tried out their subscription i paid for this so this is not sponsored by them although if they did want to sponsor me i would not definitely be down um but i got a few pieces my membership that i selected gets four pieces and then you can do one swap so you can do up to, you can get up to eight pieces in one month. Let me show you guys what I got. Hopefully you can see this, but I got the cutest, cutest dress that is just adorable. I think I want to wear it with some little white sneakers, the white sneakers that I literally wear with everything. Um, but yeah, I thought this was so adorable. I just wore this. Uh, piece in the video that I just recorded but it's like an oversized vest and it comes with what well, doesn't come with but it also has matching shorts to go with it which is so cute I got this blazer um, I think it's cute it's kind of heavy for the summertime so I don't know if I'll be wearing that besides in like a video or something sitting inside the air condition but got the blazer got the two piece for that and then got the dress so cameron is going to take some pictures of me uh sometime this week so i can do one more swap and take some more pictures so i'm i think i'm just gonna try this out for a little while to see how i like it um because i get tired of buying new stuff and then and then um I don't know and then feeling like I can't really wear it soon after at least not on social media I hate that that's a thing but like it's a thing so whatever <sighs> anyway so that's that that was a nice little pleasant surprise also a little update I have my bridal shower coming up which I'm very excited about so 
I got a dress for it, but it looks kind of praise dancer-ish. Like, I don't know if I look like I'm about to dance down the church aisle. But it's cute, but I don't know. I think I need to try it on with my makeup on. Because when I tried it on, it was before I was going to work out. And so I wasn't looking like cute, cute. So I'm going to try that on. Plus the shoes came today. So I want to see how the whole look looks. I'll let you guys know if I decide to wear that dress. Um, but it was so funny because my mom, I tried it on and she was like, I was like, it's cute, but it kind of looks like a praise dancer dress. And she, <laughs> she looked at it and she was like, it actually kind of does, but it's cute though. So y'all, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, anywho, say all that to say. Let me try that on. But you guys can't see that yet. I'll have to show you a picture on, you know, you guys can follow me on Instagram if you want to see pictures of my shower once my shower day comes. So I called my best friend and she said an absolute no for this dress. So I would try it on with the shoes, but I'm actually going to wear the shoes. So I won't show you guys the shoes, but I'm so sad. Cause this dress looks so, it is a cute dress. It is a cute dress. I'll try it on with some different shoes so you guys can see how it looks with heels on. Um, it is a cute dress. It's just, it looks like a church dress. Besides the back. It looks like I'm about to like waltz down the aisle with my praise dancing sisters. So, here is the dress. Summertime, I wanted to wear something flowy and kind of loose. I think it's the length, but the back is out as well, which is cute. But I think it's the length that feels very, I don't know, just not it for me. I love the sleeves, but I think they add to like that churchiness look that I'm just not really going for. So cute dress i may still keep it but not wear it for the shower i just paired it with these little clear sandals but i don't know let me know what you guys think all right it is time for the instagram audit in the e-brand club so i am about to get on that right now it is Instagram audit day. I'm very excited. I feel like we haven't done one of these in a while either. All right, let's see what we got. We've got quite a bit of entries. It's always so hard to pick. Okay, this is real cute. Makeup fashion. That's the vibes I'm getting. Okay, so you're doing a salad. I feel like I'm always just pooped by the end of the day. Just completely pooped. Anyway, today was fun. Um, busy, but fun. And yeah, I feel very spacey right now because I'm just kind of tired. But um, yeah, I'm gonna wash my face, get ready for bed. Tomorrow's gonna be pretty busy too. Um, I have a few meetings and then Friday I'm probably going to take pictures in these outfits that I showed you guys from Rent the Runway so that I can send them back and get another batch of outfits before my month expires and um, and then Friday we're gonna go check on the house which I'm very excited about um, we have a meeting with the builders you guys I don't know if I ever have to build a house ever again it has been a very trying time <laughs> um, but I'm glad that the house is, is still they're still moving on it and it's gonna be done by October um, so there's that 
aside from that i think that's pretty much it so i'm going to end the vlog here i'm gonna go watch married at first sight y'all i'm so excited because on wednesdays i really look forward to watching that um after i finish with my audit or whatever live i have going on in the club so i'm gonna probably take a shower wash my face um watch married at first sight find another shower dress because I can't be looking like a praise dancer at the shower. No offense to any praise dancers out there, but I just, not the look I was going for. So, <laughs> um, I love you guys so much. You are welcome to subscribe if you want. Um, if you don't, just come back next Wednesday. I mean, you don't have to subscribe. You could just come back, you know, every week. That's fine. Um, but I love you guys and I will see you on the next one. Peace.